so all is good now. My room smells amazing. Um, <laughs> anyway, so what we're going to go ahead and do is head to the salon now. Um, let's see. Let's see. Actually, what we need to do first is go ahead and book the party. We're going to throw party. No, throw party at. Okay. Let's go ahead and throw the party. Come on. It's her wedding day. Are you kidding me? Stop. Go away. It's her wedding day. Leave her alone. <laughs> um, so let's go ahead and get this going. <laughs> and the location is right... Uh, where is it? Where did it go? What? What? It's right here. So, goodness gracious. Um, so I will be right back. I'm going to make that available for, um, throw a party there. Come on now. My, my brain needs to speed up. Okay. So now we are going to go ahead and invite people to our party. Uh, so the first person that we're going to invite is, um, Mariah's friend, Ariella. Ariella. All right. Um, Ariella, we will invite, I guess, Sadie. <laughs> Um, no, we have to invite Sadie so she sees us marrying her man. Or her old man. Technically not her man anymore. Haha. <laughs> uh, we're gonna invite Rich 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 Richmond. Oh, Rich Richmond. Oh. Um, we're going to invite Bray Savage because, you know. I've hung out with him a couple of times. We don't have friends, so. <laughs> Which is kind of sad, but it's okay. Um, we will also invite, I guess, Javid, because I wanted her to kind of get to know him. Um, and we will invite, oh, where is that guy that I thought, oh, here he is. Where is he? Hold on, I just lost him. That I thought Cindy, Cindy would look really, really cute with. Um, where is he? He disappeared. Oh, is that him? No, I don't think that's him. Come on, I'm trying to find him for her. Well, we're going to invite Evan as well, just in case, you know, Javid isn't the one. I don't know, I don't know where he is. Hmm. That sucks. I really wanted to invite him for Cindy. Oh, well. Oh, well. And it'll be formal attire, of course. Um... No! Oh no! I didn't mean to do that! I meant to change the time! <laughs> I am like internally crying. I meant for the wedding to be at like 5 p.m. Alright, well the wedding's at noon. Everybody. The wedding is at noon. Which means we have about 20 minutes to get this girl ready. So what we're going to do really, really quickly is I suppose... Oh, this is going to be hard. Um, I'm just going to go in here. Instead of taking her to the salon and getting everything prepared individually, I'm just going to go ahead and change her hair and makeup. Well, not really her hair, but just her makeup, I guess, really quickly. I don't know. We'll see. Because I can't pick them for individual outfits and everything. Oh, goodness. Why do I do this to myself? I do this to myself. Um... Okay, I'm going to change her appearance. I'm going to change it back after the wedding. Um, so, yeah, just give me one second. Okay, okay, so I moved my mic um, again. I felt like it sounded like we were in a whole different place, like you were in a different room, and I was, like, yelling from the hallway. I don't know. Just let me know, guys. I'm, like, really bad with audio quality. I just, it's not my thing. Anyways, so this is the outfit I went with. I know some of you guys are probably looking at her like, she looks like a bobblehead. I know, I know, she does. She has a big head. I have a big head. It's okay. She looks beautiful, though. Like, one thing I have to constantly remind people about is that she is no longer, like, you know, a young adult. She's now an adult. Um, so she's gonna have wrinkles and whatnot. Um, but, you know, I think she looks beautiful. Um, I do. So, I, I like it. And her dress came with Monte Vista from The Sims 3 store. Um, because this is a winter wedding, I didn't want to go with something short-sleeved and, I don't, I don't know. I just felt like this, um, really captivated 
you know, a winter theme. So anyways, we're about to be late to our wedding, so we need to get going. Okay, so here we are, finally. I know, right? That we're finally here at our wedding, an hour late, no biggie. So we're just gonna go ahead and get the, uh, the whole marriage ceremony going. So we're gonna go ahead and, uh, let's see. Go here, Trey, go here. Uh, so yeah, it is time to get married with this old man, Mr. Evan here with no shirt on. It's just, it fits, it's perfect. Alrighty, so these two are gonna come here and get married. I'm gonna have everybody come over here. Hopefully they'll shut up and just watch the wedding. His face is really long. It's like literally Sarah Jessica Parker. Don't get me wrong. I love Sarah Jessica Parker. Okay, everybody go away. Look, look at Naomi laughing at Rich. I love it. <laughs> um, so yeah, let's get this started. I just love how nobody can ever shut up. Everybody sit down. Seriously? Seriously? People are booing. I love it. Okay. So they're officially married. I am super happy about this. Um, I, I don't know. I think the theme of their wedding for one is absolutely gorgeous. Alrighty, so I don't know. Like everybody's, oh, look at little Javid here. He's the one that she needs to be with. Look, they're literally standing right next to each other. Throwing some rice. I love it. Oh. I'm so happy. Look at them. So happily in love. Alrighty, so now for the guests that actually did come. Um, we can't cut this cake. I don't think I brought a buffet table. Oh, there's one right here. The convenience. Um, the snow is too deep. AKA FML. Uh, <laughs> only downside of throwing a snow party um i guess that's okay uh what we're gonna go ahead and do i guess is kind of leave our party yes we're gonna leave our party and we actually have shows tonight um which kind of sucks i don't think they're gonna do their shows i think they're gonna take like a break um because it is their wedding day um and they're actually going to no you're not going to your gig they're gonna kind of run away from everybody um, and go eat at the bistro, I guess, have a nice dinner together, and I do want them to probably go to, um, uh, either France or, France or Egypt, um, and I am going to customize the world a little bit and put some fun stuff down in either one of those worlds for them to do, um, but yeah, it will be their honeymoon and it will only be one part, but let's see. I, where the hell is the bistro? Where is the bistro? Like, I cannot find it anywhere. <laughs> it's like nowhere to be found. Where is the bistro? Find me the bistro game. I found it. The game didn't need to. Uh, so we're going to go ahead and eat here with not Naomi. What? <laughs> <laughs> not with Naomi. We're gonna come here with your wife. Not Naomi. Why why is that his only option? Weird. Okay, well. Oh well. I guess we just won't go eat at the bistro. But we are going to spend some uh I guess because this is a winter wonderland theme. Uh we will go ahead and make a snowman with Mariah, huh? And here's Naomi. Evan is actually questioning her. And Javid's over here, like, making a snowman. I like Javid better. Um, so we're gonna come over here and actually, um, oh, he's coming to talk to us. Oh, he's gonna flirt with us. Oh my goodness, he's definitely wanting it. I'm down. Come here, Javid. I like him. 
Okay, so that's exactly, you know who didn't show up? Sadie. She did not show up. She was probably like, I can't witness my man be taken away from me. I just, I can't. Well, good thing he didn't show up then, Sadie, because he's ours now. Anyway, so I guess Javid's gonna come over here and actually flirt with Naomi, which, I mean, I'm down for. I am. Rich, yeah, you're here with nobody. Make that snowman all by yourself. Seriously. You're a jerk. I don't like you. Look at Mariah. Go away. Go away. Where's Javid? Come on. Listen to insult by Javid. What? Everybody's, like, trying to talk to Naomi right now. Okay, well, Javid, if you're about to insult us, I don't know. Um... Okay, well, I kind of liked him. I don't know. I just, I do. Uh, so we're going to come over here, discuss work, complain about video. Why is she getting interrupted? Oh my goodness, Portia. Can you not? She's trying to talk to her future moneymaker. What is wrong with you? Would you go, Portia, go home. Oh my God, seriously, go home, go home. Wow. Okay. Anyways, back to what I was trying to do. Okay, it seems that freaking Evan is trying to talk to us more. Does really nobody want to talk to her? Talk to Javid. Rich, get out of here. Get out of here. Rich, go. Go away. Let her talk. You are out of here. Seriously. Now I regret even inviting. Yes, run home. Run home so annoying okay so like i was saying oh that's because mariah's on a group okay um disband group and we are going to head to the bistro now with our husband <laughs> um we're gonna eat here with trey and Naomi's gonna go ahead and chill with Javid for a little bit and kind of, you know, flirt it up with him and maybe, come on. Evan's like, I'm gonna shout for Bay. Bay, pick me. <laughs> but yeah, back to talking to Javid. Bay, pick me. <laughs> it's not happening, Evan. Leave. Um, so we are going to request a compliment because she's a diva um oh and he's a performance artist that's pretty cool we're gonna express our humiliation and um we're going to mooch a large no no we're not gonna mooch money off him yet that's coming soon though um talk about our many accomplishments which she does have a lot of accomplishments actually um so, I'll give her that one. A busboy tripped over and knocked his entire cart of desserts all over you. I guess we'll be kind. Even if, like, I was in my wedding dress, I would definitely yell at him, but... We'll be kind. We'll be kind. I guess. <laughs> um, but yeah, we are going to... Let's see, let's see. Ask him if he's single. Um... Ask a sign. Look at this. Mooch a few simoleons off Javid. She already knows what we're about to do with him. <laughs> Compliment his appearance. Um, his personality. He's a hopeless romantic. Awesome. Oh, he's in. He's in. He is totally in for it. Um, we're going to give him a flirtatious little joke. We're going to wink at him. I love this. <laughs> and we are going to confess our attraction. We're going to be like, there's nothing about uh, about you that I don't like. He's like, stop it, girl. Stop. <laughs> uh, uh, the paparazzi is here. She's about to capture all of this. She, they're about to kiss. They're about to kiss. Make it happen. No! Stop. Is he literally going to leave at that very moment? Are you... Seriously? You are about to get a kiss from a young, hot sugar mama. Okay, she does not look like a hot, young sugar mama here. 
What the hell? I'm about to give everybody a makeover. Oh. <gasps> we thought she didn't show up. We thought Sadie was hiding. Reality, Sadie was actually lurking. Lurking. She literally was peering through the bushes. Wow. She knew. She watched that whole wedding. She just didn't come to watch. How creepy. Oh, really, though? So creepy. All right. So, Trey, you're not going to your gig. Give it up, Mariah. It's your freaking wedding day. Stop. So she threw an amazing party. After throwing that party, Mariah is feeling great. She's starting to get the hang of hosting parties. That's good. That's good. I'm happy that she's happy. So we're going to invite, um, go home, get inside so we can invite him over. Um, we're going to invite Javid over and take off our granny coat, <laughs> put on that hot outfit again. Um, but yeah, we're going to invite over, uh, Javid and I will be changing back, uh, Mariah's appearance for sure. Sure. I'll come over in a little while. Goody two shoes. That, that made no sense. Um, we're going to go ahead and head in here and actually change Mariah's appearance now. Uh, just back to, you know, what she had before because I felt like that hairstyle really, really suited her. So that's what we're going to go ahead and do. Okay. So here. And so we're going to do the ponytail. Where is it? I don't know. It is. Where is it? <laughs> I need it. It's a good hairstyle. She just has like a very oddly shaped face, such as me. Um, we'll do this one. And I mean, her makeup looks fine. I, I kind of like the eyeshadow, so kind of stick with that. Maybe put a little bit of eyeliner on it. Maybe, possibly. I kind of like that eyeliner and it's from the base game. I don't know, I kind of think it looks nice. Yeah, I actually really like that eyeliner with her eyes. We're going to do that one. <laughs> I think it looks really cute, so why not, right? It's from the base game. Oh, and I also took off her colored contacts. I felt like her natural eyes were really shining through, so. Yeah, she's she's checking herself out like, who is that hot botch? <laughs> I think she looks pretty good. For, you know, her, okay, not there. Not there. What is going on with that? <laughs> Mariah, you are scaring me. She needs to change the face. Um, people used to say that to me when I was younger. Like, as a joke, people would be like, what's up with the face? Or, you're uglier than a bag of rocks. I've gotten that one a few, a few dozen times. <laughs> My dad actually called me that when I was younger. Like, that was his, uh, his pun. You're uglier than a bag of rocks. I was like, okay. You made me. <laughs> it's, it's like, you're half of me. Um... Okay, so Javid's here. Um, you could come inside, Javid. You don't have to hide outside. Um, uh, let's see. Can we call him over? I don't know, but we're just going to go ahead and uh, embrace him and give him our first, well, not our first kiss, but his first kiss, maybe? Oh, and she's back in that ugly outfit. Oh, girl, you're getting a makeover. Everybody is. Look, her blonde hair looks like it's like uh, she's an elder. Oh my goodness. This is so wrong. Well, it's not wrong. I just feel like he's my grandpa. <laughs> uh, Portia. <gasps> Portia. Portia is like, what is going on out here? Portia, go away. She knows. Oh, she's going to go accuse her mom of being a diva. Oh, what a good daughter. Really, guys. Such a good daughter. Um, So I guess we're going to um wink... Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. She wants to woohoo with him. Let's make out with him. Let's go ahead and make out with him. And we're going to propose going steady. <laughs> oh my gosh. Um, yeah, this is actually happening. <laughs> I find this so funny because he reminds me of my grandpa. Like, that's what my grandpa looks like. Um... Hopefully this guy even has money. If not, I'm going to make him have money. 
because I didn't do this for no reason. Um, and we're going to... He's now our boyfriend, everybody. We're going to now propose marriage. This is actually happening. It's happening this quick too, everybody. It's, it's nothing special. This is happening. He's probably like, I cannot risk this. I'm taking it. She's hot. Um, so yeah, another wedding on the way and then a divorce. Um, so yeah, this is happening. I know a lot of people was like, Naomi does not deserve that. Don't worry, guys. Naomi's being, like, a complete, like, she's being a, a G right now. She's about to, like, take all this old man's money and then bank it and then find her man, okay? She is about to pull. <sighs> she's about to pull. How can I put it? A gold digger times ten. Um, so, yeah. We're actually going to, because he's so in love with us, we're going to mooch a large sum of money. Evan Bess would like to know if Mariah Doran, <gasps> I love it, would like to go on a date. No. She's married now, so. We got 320 bucks. 20 bucks. 20 bucks. She's enthusing about the wedding. She's like, I can't wait. This is what I need. 20 bucks, though. Javi, that's pretty freaking cheap. Okay, so we're going to say goodbye. We're not going to kiss him goodbye. Um, okay, weird. I wanted more than that, but I guess so. <laughs> Off camera, I'm going to make him super rich. <laughs> and we're going to just take all that money. Anyways, um... I'm going to go ahead and end this part here, everybody. Uh, off camera, I'm going to give everybody a makeover because just ratchet. That's all I have to say. Um, in the next part as well, we will be going on our honeymoon. And I also want you guys in the comments down below. I want you guys to know if you think uh, Cindy should end up with that really cute guy. that I think they would look so cute together in the last part we were talking to him. Um, let me know. I don't know how paparazzi got in the house. Okay, oh my god, that is so scary. She's like asleep and he's sitting here with a mask like, yes! <laughs> oh, go! And he's taking pictures of her! That, oh, that is so scary. My worst nightmare. With like, no makeup on. Straight bags under the eye. Oh, that is so scary. He's like literally giving her the death eye. Go home. Go home! Oh. Anyways, <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed this part. Um, so yeah, I will see you all next time, okay? Bye, guys.